Oh, this? This girl not my scalp. This is as close to Beyonce that I would get. Like that Beyonce color. Y'all probably like, girl, Beyonce blonde blonde. Yes, this is as close as I will get. I said what I said. Hello! I am about to give you probably the shortest hair review I'll ever give because there really isn't much to say about this hair or much to really do to it. So, um, let's get started. The wig that I have on my head is from the Janet collection. It is called June! <sighs> so, my birthday is actually in June and my... My username for like my Instagram and like Twitter back in the day used to be like June Pearl. Like I just love June. So I got this unit um, off of wigtypes.com. I will leave the links down below. I got a couple of wigs actually. I also ordered June and black on 1B because that's obviously the safer color. And I saw a review, I saw multiple reviews for this particular color. But I was trying to find a review with women with my complexion as chocolate as I am just to see how it looked on them and I think I found one and it looked really good on her so I'm like uh, it's only $20 let me just get it right so then I got it this was the first one I opened when the package came and I have been unable to take it off since obviously I took it off when I go to sleep because this is not human hair but I love this hair like I love 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 this hair and for two reasons one this style like the curl pattern the way that the front is framed is absolutely beautiful it gives me romance it gives me relax it gives me date night it gives me everything and two this color is beautiful this color is subtle so it kind of looks like um I have a review on the Equal Free Trans Way Carissa and OP OP430. Um, so it kind of mimics that color, but this one is a bit darker and it has like streaks of lighter colors. Like this is just a better this is just a better like dye job or color job, if that makes sense. So when I got it, I just cut the lace. Um, the lace on the front and the part was really tight so you're definitely going to need to pluck or shave whatever however way you um, do your part but I used the um, eyebrow razor and I made a part and this time I usually use concealer to um, help my part um, match with my skin color but this time I actually use foundation I, uh, I use my Fenty um, foundation color. I think I'm 140. I think is it, it's either 140 or 120, but I think it's 140. But anyway, I use the Fenty, and I like that. I like this result much better because it's just more close. It's it's much closer to my skin color, my skin complexion. I'm most likely gonna wear the black one as an everyday wig like to school and stuff and um this sugar brown one i am going to use it like an occasion wig you know it's like your sunday's best <laughs> so this is one of the extended part um lace wigs which means the part goes all the way back here i don't care for extended parts i actually like it when my part is pretty short quite frankly so um yeah that is that is really all so far i am going to turn around a bit and give you um some other angles of the wig but like i really need you guys to see the color like it's imperative that you get a chance to really examine this color for yourself and for all of my brown skin um ladies i Girl, I know the struggle, okay? Um, like we cannot just be, not every um, hair color is going to work with our brown. Oh, and also like on the bottom, it gets like lighter, but not like obnoxiously light, you know? So, yes! Whatever I tell you, 
say, whatever happened me, I tell you, say.